That was uh, Diablo 2, Lord of the Destruction. Uh, I can finally check that off my list after having played that like 15 years ago. Man. All right, success. Oh man, that last fight sucked so much. Was that the intended idea? Was to keep teleporting in and out like that? That could have been the intended thing, and if so, that sucks even more. But that's, you know, this is back in the days when video gaming was first getting a, a, a foothold and no one really knew what made a great game. Like everything up till that fight, the, like everything except the boss fights for the most part were awesome. The the uh, the mini boss fights were not so bad. You know, like Iswal, but they all just had like massive health pools that you just had to wade through for the most part. So I don't know. I wonder how it'd have been with a uh, like a sorceress or something with a glass canyon. And like, if if I'm gonna compare it to like a Diablo three, I'm trying to think of um, the last boss. I forgot his name. The angel, who becomes the angel of death or whatever. Like he's got a pretty big health pool too, at least on harder difficulties. Um, but. He has mechanics and stuff you have to do, like you have to dodge certain things and run around the arena. Although, you know, that would have been very taxing for something like that. This stuff, when they did AOEs, it just kind of centered on them and psh, shot out, you know, little spinny things. Probably wasn't quite in the realm of possibility back in the days, but oh man, that fight. Yeah, you do have the most meat squares. Yeah, you've been that way for a few months now. Also, I've been thinking about changing the names of those. I've been thinking about changing the names of a lot of things. Uh, we can talk about that since the credits are going on. Uh, I kind of want to change the meat squares to be uh, bully bits or uh, bully bucks. Um, and I kind of want to change the name of the discord to be the pit stop because, you know, pities. And uh, I think we'll we can call the name of like the followers and stuff uh, the pit crew. I kind of like that. And I had another name. Um, or, or the bullpen. Maybe bully dogs. So I'm, 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 I'm kind of thinking about those. Uh, yeah, I call the uh, bits pity bitties. Um, unfortunately, since you are a mod and, and stuff, you don't see that um, icon. But I made a special dog bone icon for bits. And uh, they're called pity bitties. Excuse me. But uh, in terms of the rewards monies, I'm thinking bully bucks. Because they're not just from bits. But I, I like the bullpen. I like the pit crew. I like the pit stop. I'll have to figure it out. But I, I think that will be a fun little switch. And I kind of want to change up the... Um, the panels down below. They, they feel a little too heavy. Or too much. A really high bitties to unlock. Hey, Yuri, with the five bitties. They take it for the bitties. Nom, nom, nom. Um, nom, nom, nom. Oh no, the um, the little icon even comes from like someone that's uh, given one bit. Um, so I think um, like if next time Birch drops in, you'll see it on her, because um, maybe you'll see it on her. She's a sub now. Nah. No, it's uh, you get it even with uh, one bit. Because Birch has it and she's only given. I shouldn't say only, that sounds terrible. She's given, I think, like 300 and she has the uh, definite. The doggy bone. And I think yours doesn't show up because you're a mod, you're a sub, and you have the Twitch Prime um, icon. I think, actually, in your settings, in your user settings, you might be able to turn one of those off and see which ones you have and turn on the bone one if you want you know that that's completely your choice hi doggo let's see i think i can yeah there's gonna be no sound because i'm not focused on the game anymore can you stop oof nut how do i do this go to my channel let's see go to the gear go to edit appearance really yeah and then the badges you can choose which ones to turn on and off.
Yeah, and unfortunately, the thing that bothers me is the thing at the very top that shows, like, the bit leaders. Those should use my icons, man. That's a bummer. It really bums me out. Oh, your next badge unlocks in that mini. Yeah, so, so you have a badge, technically. You just don't see it because of all your other uh, icons and stuff that you have. Ooh. Goodness gracious me. Yeah, at, at their, like, after I think a thousand bits, the, uh, the scales that Twitch allows for bit badges is ridiculous. It's like a thousand, five thousand, ten thousand, twenty thousand, and I think fifty thousand is like, that's too big of jumps, man. Um, so, did you click on that link I sent you, um, in Streamlabs? Or in, um, sorry, in Twitch. I sent it to you in a whisper. That should take you there. I don't know if I have to, I had to be live or something when it happened. And, uh, beyond that, I don't know. Um, Fraggers redeemed a winner thing before. Um, but as far as I know is he just had a log in with Streamlabs or with Twitch through that link and then it verified that it was you and then you just like had to give your name and address and it should be done. It's not making it easy. Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't know. I don't know anything. I've never uh, used it myself to redeem anything. I wonder. Let me see if I could do something. I'm curious myself. Let's see. Uh, giveaways. Giveaway history. Okay, yeah, so it definitely says that you want it. Which is good, so it went through. I had to open the link a second time. Oh, okay. Yeah, if sometimes it's like the person's like, log in, then you have to if you open the link again, it actually sends you the correct page. I've been noticing a lot of websites have been having that issue lately. They don't do the proper redirect. Sick. Awesome, man. When uh, when you get it, you'll have to post a, a picture in the Discord. In the the merch reppin' channel or whatever. Man, actually, this game had a long credits. Holy crap. Look at all those Brian's. It's a wall of Brian. Oh, oh you t <laughs> I see you turned off um, your Twitch Pride badge. And now you have the badge of a bit leader. <laughs> you just can't get that doggo bone one, can you? Hey, did you hear, did you hear doggo? Did you hear doggo? Yeah, on your face. You got a thing on your face, Jaya. You clicked the end of the game. Oh, crap. Uh... Oh, crap. I wasn't sure if this game was gonna last me. I was kind of hoping it was gonna last through tomorrow. I wasn't hoping that. I was wanting it to be done. But I was kind of thinking it was gonna last through tomorrow. Because I was gonna spend some time getting some new alerts and stuff for our next game. To play. Which I am super, super excited for. I'm gonna send out a message to all the subs and stuff. Um, I'm gonna be playing one of my favorite games of all time. I am super excited for it. Um, Final Fantasy 7. I can't wait to play it. I'm gonna have to find my old school CDs and stuff. Um, as well. I, I, they, I know where they should be. So I'll have to check for that. But, I'm excited to play it because the remake is coming out soon. So everyone that's never played it, I want them to experience with me. Like, the graphics are horrible, but the story is amazing. I want to experience all the like joys and stuff of playing that game and then i want everyone to experience the remake fresh brand new with me as well just so we can all enjoy it on the same level of playing field of enjoyment i'm excited for that do i own mini mushroom i think i own mini mushroom do i i own another a train game similar 
No, it hasn't been remastered yet. It's been it's been in the works for like six or seven years. It was stupid like that. And they keep pushing it out. However, they did this month just release a new trailer for it. And uh, they said June, they're going to have another announcement about it. So I think it might be actually released the end of this year. And I am super incredibly stoked for that. Oh, screw this. That was rude. I didn't even, like, I didn't even think that was going to be bad. I was going to be like, oh, this is just going to be a, a small puff of air. And then all of a sudden, the sound started coming out, and I could not. And I went to go push the mute microphone button, but apparently I don't have it on this scene. Oh my goodness, we hit the end of the Diablo 2 credits. Holy crap, holy. And you're just gonna have us sit here? And like, he's just like, hey, what are you doing? Hey, you're just having. No! <laughs> the end. Comes away later. Is it gonna stop in the middle? No. He's just having a staring contest with this. Captain America Bullman. Seriously, he's red, white, and blue. He looks like Captain America. With hooves. Music's fading out. It makes me think something's gonna happen. That's a druid, so hurrah. Is the music not fading out? Is my mind just playing tricks on me? Or it just restarted. I think it just restarted. Oh. <laughs> it's just the whole menu screen. Cinematics. There's actually cinematics? I don't remember there being cinematics. It doesn't work. Is there supposed to be cinematics in this game? And they don't work? Blizzard! Your download is broken. Aw oh, man, is there actually cinematics in this game? Did we miss out the cinematics? Diablo 2, Lord of Destruction. Cinematics. Hold up here. There's totally cinematics, guys. <gasps> I got screwed. All right. Hold on. Um, we need to, uh, we need to watch these. Hold on a minute. I'm gonna browser source this. And then, um. We need to watch all these. Hold up. Please hold. I need to resize some things. We can watch this all together now. All together now. Oops. 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 Something. I don't know. This will be good enough. Good enough. I'm really bummed that the cinematics didn't work. I kind of want to report to Blizzard that they're broken in their uh, their file. 
for their download. Oh, it's a poor guy. So, Marius, at last I find you. Whoa. Terio. Yes. Yes, now. Now I recognize you. you. I should have known you'd travel in the skies. There. They're always watching. I've been searching for you for a long time, Marius. I was rather beginning to think you didn't want to be found. Oh, forgive me, Tyrio, please. It, it wasn't my fault. Not your fault. Tell me, Marius. Doesn't even sound like Tyrio. How was it not your fault? The Wanderer. Yes, it was, was the Wanderer. My days at the Rogue Citadel seemed so long ago. I sought refuge from my memories in the company of other outcasts high in the mountains past the Eastern Gate. Do you want something? <laughs> Do you want something? <laughs> Making all sorts of goofy noises. Oh, I fought sleep for days at a time. For when I dreamt, the memories would return. Memories of the monastery and the evil. Which had claimed it. Dreams, memories. I couldn't tell the difference anymore. Had the evil from my dreams followed me at my heels? How had he found me here? How could this broken shell of a man, barely able to carry the weight of his own sword, be the burning terror which drove me to hide here? That's how you start a fire. What the? Oh, snap. I want to get out of there. As I watched, I, I became convinced that I was truly bad. The terror, the destruction, the, the evil I witnessed. How else could I explain them? Were these the demons from my dream, or were they born? Oh, he's just a hungry boy.
I do not remember these at all. Drunk up his gourd. Ow. What just happened? He sucked his soul back into his life. Made him all go back. Is that what happened? Kind of confused what's going on. Well, he ain't scared of fire. Why did I follow him? I don't know. Why do things happen as they do in dreams? All I know is that when he beckoned, I had to follow him. And from that moment, we traveled together east. Always into the east. Diablo 2. I'm bomb, man. These were not in the game. Into the vast deserts of broken lands. As the days passed, my companion told me of himself that he had once been a great warrior, and that a dark and secret burden now weighed heavily upon him. We traveled for an eternity across that barren wasteland. How long? Oh, poor camel. I couldn't say. And always. Oh, don't kick him. Seemed to follow us you jerk. Over the horizon. Finally, the journey ended. We if he knows he's got demons and stuff. Why is he following him? Our destination. The shining jewel root lane. With a great. camp that last night perhaps it was the warm desert wind or the sound of the ocean but for the first time in many weeks i slept however really next to a demon man but these were clearly not my own okay. i held a vision of a great man the mage talrasha you were there too Tyrion. i remember seeing you in my dream his brethren had cornered a great demon, Baal, the Lord of Destruction, who had been set loose upon the world. They attempted to imprison the demon within a sacred stone. Yet when their attempts failed, Tarasha selflessly volunteered to contain the demon within himself, completing the prison. He instructed his brethren to bind him within a tomb, buried under the sand, there to wrestle with the demon for all eternity. That sounds awful. Next morning, we walked over the hill toward Lutgulain. I had no idea then of the horrors that were in store for me there. My companion drew in the dank, cold air of the tomb. It drew in the dank. To strengthen him. 
I stood in the doorway between light and dark. What was left of my sanity implored me not to enter. But that voice was just a whisper now. As we worked our way down deeper and deeper into the crypt, I began to see a change in my companion. He seemed to be gaining strength. I could hardly see in the gloom, but my companion seemed to know the way. You know the way? We came at last to a great hall. I haven't taken a dump in centuries. Oh, goodness. Uh. It was then I realized my companion hadn't been gaining strength. He had been losing what was left of his humanity. He moved with demonic speed, and then, then you appeared. Stop! The beast contained herein shall not be set free, not even by you. That's why you cut all those bridges and step down. Just ensured the doom of this world. You cannot even begin to imagine what you've set in motion this day. Go to the Temple of Light in the eastern city of Karast. There you will find the gate to hell opened before you. You must find the courage to step through that gate, Marius. Take the stone you hold to the Hellforge, where it will be destroyed. Now run. Take the stone and run! Uh-oh. Okay, so that's where his phalanges what come out. What did I have? I ran. I did so did Tyrael, like, Tyrael. freeze time I to do that? I found the temple of the Zakarum. In the deepest recesses of the temple, I found a dark gathering. My companion, the Wanderer. Russia and a great evil who could only be the lord of hatred himself. Mephisto. I heard a voice That's what you look like? Gross. Like a thousand needles in my heart. My brothers, at long last we stand reunited. The infernal gate has been prepared. In the time of our final victory is at hand. Let the way to hell be open. And the evil that was once vanquished shall rise anew. Wrapped in the guise of man, shall he walk amongst the innocent, and terror shall. 
shall consume they that dwell upon the earth. The sky shall rain fire, and the seas will become as blood. The righteous shall fall before the wicked, and all creation shall tremble before the burning standards of hell. But I saw them was not meant for mortal eyes. The gate stands ready. Time has come to assume your true form. Oh, it's uh, D Demon Sonic. Arise, Diablo, Lord of Terror. The Kemi walks. I love it. I was just a normal, half insane dude. I wouldn't want to go in there either. Marius, give me the stone, and all is forgiven. That's not Tyrael. It's not Tyrael, is it? Tell me, Marius. Take it, take it, take it. I'm glad this is finally over, Tyrion. Oh, look what the stone has done to me. Oh. You haven't failed, old man. You've done exactly as you were meant to do. However, I am not the Archangel Tyriel. I was going to say, it didn't even sound like him. Well, no. No, 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 no. No. <laughs> you have done well, Marius. Now I think you shall have your reward. Oh, dude. You just explode him? And then lit his thing on fire? Dude, that poor guy. A bunch of roaches? <laughs> the, the little soot sprites.
It looks like, um, what's it called? Bastion's Keep? Is that the name of it in Diablo 3? That's my favorite act in Diablo 3. The gates of Sacheron have stood for eons beyond remembrance. And you shall not reach them now. Remove your foul demons from our lands. We they just talk to demons nonchalantly like that? And you shall not I'll be, like, be allowed to reach Mount Ariat. And that which you seek will not be yours. Enough! 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 For that kind of exact reason. They are more than human. Be like, nope, don't mess with them. You're gonna get eaten, fat boy. I shall take your position into consideration. Well, it seems your terms are not acceptable. <laughs> Look at his creepy legs. <laughs> Ugh. This must be going to pandemonium, right? Keep dropping your sword. No, 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 don't play another one. 
Was that actually it? Like, is there more? I wasn't sure if there's more or not. I feel like that was it, though. I'll just boop, get rid of that. But yeah, I guess, um... That was Diablo 2 cinematics. I wish, um... They showed up in my game. I don't know why they didn't. Their pathing must be broken or something with the installer. Let's see. Uh... Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so that might have been all of them. Yeah, because the other one is a... That last one with Bale was a cinematic intro for Lord of the Destruction. Okay, that was it. Dang, I kind of wish those were included in the... um. I need to move OBS away from that monitor staring at myself this freaking out i wish they would have included that in the uh, the actual game i would have probably added to the immersion a little bit because i was just kind of going um didn't feel any connection to the storyline at all and that was kind of a bummer i wish those were there anyway um also i do i am in the process of thinking whether or not i'm going to be ending streams at around 10 p.m my time so that's an hour earlier um i may start doing that because i'm not sleeping anymore it's awful yeah, yeah, and I'm I'm done for that. Nate. Oh, you just got back. He just missed all the cin cinematics. Apparently, uh, none of the Diablo two cinematics played while we were playing in the game. So I just went and found them on YouTube and played them. You're here with the five beaters. You want some more beaters? I want some more. Say you're already taking more beaters. Nom 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 nom. You want one two hippo? You want one two hippo? Nom nom nom. Good stuff. Good stuff. Thanks for the bits, my dude. Uh, can't wait for you to get your cup. I'm excited for that. It turned out mine turned out really nice, so I'm I'm happy with it. So I hope you will be too. Um, but crap, dude. I don't know if I'm gonna put off starting seven till next week or if I'll start tomorrow. I kind of wanted to create special alerts and stuff for it, and I wouldn't have time to do it. So. Maybe I will start next week, and that'll give me time to create some alerts. That'll give me time to actually find the game and uh, test it out and stuff. It's going to work. So, eh, maybe tomorrow and, um, yeah. Oh, yeah, so we only have two days left of stream this week. So, yeah, we'll play some fun games or something. And then uh, next week we'll be playing Final Fantasy VII, which I'm super crazy excited for. <laughs> give it to Sarah for Office Tea Mug. Heck, yeah, she'll love it. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so... Thank you guys for tuning in with me. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, remember to like, subscribe, comment. Helps me out a lot. Let's me know what you're liking and what you're not liking. Yuri, thank you for all those biddies. And Skyward, thank you so much for the host. I appreciate it. He'll be around after your EMG tomorrow. Hey, hey, good luck on that, dude. Excuse me. Holy crap. Jada, you're gonna click buttons. But, uh... <laughs> did Mama's peek in? <laughs> Jada's all stretching around here. You want, you want to get up and go to bedtime and go party and get some foods? Yes, yes you do. Yes you do. Hi. Okay. Oh, stepping on sensitive bits. Hi, hippo. Okay, we got both of them. Ow, dogs here. But, uh, Yuri, thank you for the bits, man. Um, remember to spay new to your pets, adopt a shop, donate to a rescue if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is a very rewarding experience, and I cannot speak. That is a very rewarding experience. And it helps those animals and rescues out that are very much in need. Have a good one yourself, dude. I'm excited for you to get the cup. Let me know as soon as you get it in. And uh, I will catch you guys next time. See ya. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Stop it.